Hey guys, Brett Mix here, Macho Wrestling 101. Hit like and subscribe for more history of wrestling videos that I pump out every day. Uh, then we're here for another match of the day. It's going to be June the 11th, 2001. Monday Night Raw, or Raw is War back at the time. Stone Cold Steve Austin and Paul Heyman with Jim Ross are on commentary for this match. It's a steel cage match between Chris Benoit and Kurt Angle from that June 11th, 01 Raw episode. And this is just another classic in the history of Benoit versus Angle. These guys have so many different classic matches together or are incorporated in Fatal 4 Ways together, tag matches together that have gone on to be the best ever. Even teaming together against Edge and Rey Mysterio at No Mercy 02 was a 5-star match in my opinion. Not only were these two producing classics every week at the time, but this one was a classic before it began. You add a cage to the, to the work rate of both these guys and you add two crazy spots on top of the cage, both of them, this is going to be a classic. Angle with started the match with two overhead belly-to-belly -belly suplexes. Austin on commentary said he hates the snaggle tooth bastard to book Chris Benoit. Angle utilized the cage right away, sending Benoit crashing to both sides of it. And Angle sell, or Benoit's selling is such an underrated part of his repertoire. Uh, is He's known for vicious chops, and he let them out after Angle's initial offense, but his selling is so key. Heyman on commentary was great too, asking if JR knew who Steve Austin was. Do you know who this man is? And Benoit charged into Angle, and Angle, ca Angle catapulted Benoit first right into the cage. Catapulted him right head first into the cage. Angle slammed him into the cage. Austin's heel mic work with Heyman sucking up was just icing on the cake in this match. Both Angle and Benoit are so impressive together. You add the cage and just this top notch quality. Benoit with a snap suplex. Austin hates all the chops and suplexes because he hates being on the recipient end. Angle with a gut wrench suplex to Benoit and then three more after that. The first, the first cage escape, the escape attempt was Angle, but Benoit climbed with him and Angle tried to get to every top every single time, but Benoit locked his hands around Angle for a superplex off the top of the cage, off the top of the cage. Both guys were on the top rope. And Benoit locked his hands around Angle and off the side of the cage on the step, both men standing on the top rope off the side of the cage, Benoit hit a vertical suplex all the way to the canvas floor. Uh, it was just an unbelievable move. It was a superplex because it was technically off the top rope. Uh, and yeah, Angle pushes Benoit off the side of the cage and Angle comes off with an elbow drop to Benoit from the top rope again. From this point on, I'm just going to look at the big parts in the match because this was hard to keep up with. The action was so brutal and intense. Um, uh, Eagle hits a moonsault off the top of the cage. Benoit moved just in time, and this is the same move he broke Hardcore Holly's arm with back on SmackDown when he hits the moonsault off the top. But Angle did this from the top of the cage. Uh, and it's so nice to see a TV match with no commercial. Uh, Benoit hit with vicious knees into the abdomen. Benoit then hit, hit nine, and, I, and I'm not kidding, nine German suplexes in a row. Uh, Angle tried to elbow out, and he did for some of them, but then he just kept getting caught right back into another superplex. After nine superplexes, he was down, and the headbutt was down. Benoit went up flying from the top cage and hit a flying headbutt all the way from the top of the cage, down to the canvas floor. Austin was there with the chair, so Benoit couldn't climb down because obviously he had Austin's chair. So he looked backwards, and then he looked towards Angle, and he had a flying head bot off the top. Uh, Benoit was the first to his feet, and Austin throws the official into the barricade, and Benoit drop kicked the door, sending Austin to the ground. Angle grabbed Benoit, trying to escape the door with his ankle lock, but Benoit hits an enziguri. Benoit almost out of the cage door, but Austin slams the door on his head. So many headshots to Benoit, it's hard to watch, knowing what we now know. Angle then spots the opening with Benoit down to climb through the cage and out, and he wins at 14:31, with the help from Steve Austin attacking Benoit with the chair. Unbelievable match. It had both men doing their usual leverage and advantage sticks. It had both men doing their suplexes and chops, power slams, inverted gut wrench slams, suplexes, German suplexes. We had the cage bumps thrown to both sides of the cage, the moonsault off the cage, the diving headbutt off the cage, the side head to the cage, 
the catapults to the cage. Everything was smooth, vicious, no wasted motion. Every move meant something. Heyman on Austin commentary were cherry on the top with JR. Watch, as always, as this match is in the description below. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you already haven't. I rate this four and a half stars. I'm Brett Mix, and I'm out. Enjoy the match, everyone. It's in the description, as always, and I'll see you on the next one.